everybody how are you so thank you for tuning in to tingsnice.com once again and this is just a random little video that i've uh thrown together um about my trip to puerto rico which is where i am right now last year when i realized that my mother was going to turn 60 this year i wanted to do something for her to take her you know on a little getaway or whatever i really didn't know where we were going until probably about three weeks ago because I wanted to make sure that the price was right. I didn't want to spend majority of the time on a plane. You know, I wanted to go to BIM, I actually wanted to go to Jamaica, but those layovers and, and the flights that were available didn't tickle my fancy. Um, but when I looked up PR and I basically went to, um, like when you go to JetBlue and they have like these specials, I just looked to see what the specials were and PR was one of those options. I was like, you know, look, I think we can do this. Um, it's a nice way to kind of get their feet wet, experiencing a different place. You're still in the U.S., but you're still on an island. I didn't book my Airbnb until last week. I scouted it out, but I didn't purchase it until last week. And then and I sent my mother a, I sent her an itinerary that basically said, okay, this is what you need to pack. You're not going to know where you're going until you get your boarding pass. <laughs> don't ask any questions <laughs> this is everything that you need to know and she did try she tried to like pull information out of her booth she tried to pull information out of my aunt and they did very well I, I, I must admit I really thought somebody was gonna break and tell her where we were going but they did well I appreciate that and when we got here it was just very low-key and they they were like okay well what are we doing I don't know I have nothing planned beyond this these flights that I got nothing planned beyond this Airbnb that I booked the goal is sleep eat walk repeat right so I chose a location that was uh, within walking distance to restaurants walking distance to the beach walking distance to like you know little sites or whatever because they're older and everybody got their little ailments or whatever so I didn't want to be in a situation where we needed a, a, a vehicle for anything I wasn't trying to rent a car I wasn't trying to drive anywhere I just wanted it to be uh, a relaxing vacation for everybody just to get out and experience something new experience a different place so we went to one of the restaurants Sarafina uh, one night and then we took an uber to old San Juan and we went to El Jibarito which is a Puerto Rican cuisine I texted the person who I'm renting Airbnb from and I was like please send me some recommendations on where I can go to get authentic Puerto Rican cuisine so when she recommended that I was like okay bet and it was amazing it was a good trip and I knew that I was successful because <laughs> she sent me like a bunch of text messages while she was at the airport or on the plane like oh I can't believe you did this and blah 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 blah, blah. and then yesterday she was like <laughs> she was like oh this is the best birthday ever. I can't wait till 70. I was like, who told you I was doing something at 70? <laughs> but anyway, uh, she was too cute. So that was my little trip to PR. So if you're planning something for one of your loved ones and you want a nice little getaway, I definitely recommend staying down in um, I'm in Condado, San Juan, old San Juan is beautiful. And I will be back and I'm probably gonna come back to this very same Airbnb if it is available. But it's um, a really, a really nice spot, really nice time. And everybody, the people are so nice. They're so nice everywhere. Um, so I definitely, definitely recommend coming to PR and uh, having a nice little, little getaway. So it was a great, it was a great and a full two days. I was gonna go to the Bacardi Rum Factory, but I feel like we did the right thing by not going and kind of just going to Old San Juan. So. Uh, definitely recommend PR. Go to Old San Juan in the daytime so that you can see the beauty and the architecture and everything. It's like so clean and neat out here. It's ridiculous. Um, but yeah, so thanks for tuning in. I appreciate you. Stand by for another Ting's Nice vlog post. And uh, yeah, I'll be back. Bye.